Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Brits. As you can see, we're in my kitchen. Today we're making coconut curry salmon and I'm so excited to like give you guys this recipe because honestly, this is bossy. This one I'm gonna make, it's bossy, believe me. And I want you guys to like try it at home because it's so good. It is so good. But yeah, if you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. You know, don't just come and watch the video. Subscribe. You know, we're on the road to 5K. We are almost there, period. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. You know, thank you guys for the comments that you left on my last video. The like, the share, everything like. I appreciate it, you know? But yeah, let's just like get into the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Here's what we're gonna do first. So I have our salmon. I got this from CPJ online. If anybody's asking, I think I got it for like it wasn't expensive, less than four grand for this big piece of salmon. I'm gonna love that for myself. So I'm just gonna like cut it in fillet slices, um, and then I'm gonna cut that fillet in half. So I'm gonna do that so you guys can see. off with some lime juice and some water twice and now I'm just gonna like wash off the cutting board because I need it to like cut up my seasonings and stuff so we're just gonna do that and gonna use the season is adobo this is my favorite seasoning it has a lot of flavor and you no know, no it just get everything I was so you know I just I don't have any exact measurements that's one thing but I just season to my liking so I just you know season 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 with my adobo then usually I would add Cayenne pepper, honestly, you don't need a lot for this. You do not need a lot. Some cayenne pepper. Because I like when my food has a little bit of spice in it. Onion powder. Yeah, just a little. And then I use my curry. I don't know what one but this is a curry that I use better pack. I've had this since last year. But I don't really make curry often. But yeah, it lasts long. And a sprinkle my curry. You know, just a little. But now it looks like no what is the point I come out. Just a little. And then I'm gonna use a spoon. Use a spoon to mix, you know, just mix around everything, make sure all the seasonings are combined. Don't mix it too hard because you don't want your salmon breaking up. It's just like a little spin around in a bowl or whatever. Or you can just lightly use like a spoon to like rub in the seasoning. Because I don't want any curry on my fingers right now. Because I'm always like rubbing my eyes and stuff. So, yeah, you know, you just mix it around a little bit. I feel like I want to add a little bit more adobo, just a little bit. But no, it's not like no fuck I'm out, but it, it's not open, it's barely open, it's just like sprinkles stuff. Take off 
called like probably like three pegs of garlic and this is two in the next one the owner feel dead guys i have my garlic long time not long time but you know I don't like cutting my garlic too small because I don't like when I eat it, I'm gonna go bite a piece of garlic. I'm gonna like that. So I like cutting my garlic big enough for my kids to say, this is a garlic, do not eat it. Because the most annoying thing, the most annoying thing is when you bite a piece of garlic when you eat your food. Like when you cannot tell me say that do annoy me. Oh, my scotch bunny pepper. This is a must. It is a must. Usually I use like more than half. This is not even half. This is more than half. And then the most important step. I'm gonna have to bring it off to you guys. The most important step. 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 The most important step is sweet pepper. This add flavor it adds so much flavor to the curry like i don't feel like it makes sense to cook this dish without your sweet pepper it don't make no sense like you need it you need it you need it it just add a difference because you know so sweet pepper is definitely needed Onion, my garlic, my scotch bonnet pepper, and sweet pepper. You don't need nothing else. Nothing else. So before I even like sit on that, my salmon and everything, I think I'm just gonna like start the rice. Because I feel like the rice is gonna take a little bit longer to cook. Why is something not cooked? Yeah, the rice is gonna probably take longer to cook. So I'm just gonna like start the rice from now. So if you watch my last video, you know how I make rice. I make it in my little pots. So I just stir in my rice. Washing my rice. I usually wash my rice like two times. I should probably make more rice. This is a little bit. So I usually throw off the water one time and then I just like wash it the next time. But yeah, my bottle. Again, this is the one that I use, the gold seal margarine. It's my butter. I just put a piece in there and then I use my salt. Real Jamaicans no se. Salt and sugar is never in an actual salt bottle or an actual sugar bottle. This is a this is a creamy peanut butter bottle. Yeah. Okay guys, so time for the fun part. <laughs> so I have our salmon and then I have my vegetable oil, then I have my curry powder and I have my seasoning. So I'm just gonna add you guys on so you can see exactly what I'm doing because I don't want to just talk and you guys don't see what I'm doing. So yeah, y'all won't be seeing my face, but that's okay. So we're just gonna turn on the stove. Um, yeah. This is the oil. So I'm just gonna like put some oil in the pots.
just enough. Um, curry put a little bit more because it's gonna dry out and yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna turn the pot down to medium heat because I don't like when the oil is too hot because I feel like it burning seasonings. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to add some curry to the oil to burn my curry. Then I'm just gonna, you know, then I'm gonna add my seasonings. I always do that first. Usually I add my seasonings first because I feel like it just adds more flavor to the pot when you know all the seasonings kind of like combined in the oil before I add my salmon. So that's why I do my own that way. Some people add them salmon first, but I feel like it just like add more flavor to the meal. So I just usually like cook up my seasonings in the oil first and then that's when I add my salmon. So yeah, I recommend that you guys do it this way because you get more flavor out of it. Okay, so usually I add my salmon skin side down first. All right, let me just. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna allow the salmon to cook on each side for about like uh, six minutes. So six minutes on the side of the skin and six minutes on the side of the skin and then uh, that's when I add my coconut milk. So right now I'm just gonna like mix up my coconut milk in hot water. Do not mix your coconut milk in cold water because you don't want to change like the whole temperature of your pot. The food authority, why are you gonna put cold water on it? Yo, man, it's so hot water only. So guys, what I did was I threw off the excess oil. So I'm just gonna like flip it back over now. Now that I throw off the oil. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw the coconut milk in the same pan with the curry. I forgot to set the water out. I forgot to pack the water is hot. And just like, you know, Mix around all the seasonings that were in there before to get all the flavor. And I'm just gonna throw this coconut milk on my salmon. Yeah. So I'm gonna turn the stove off. So now that this is boiling up, I'm gonna add my sweet pepper so that all the flavor can come out. So 
And you basically just allow this to cook down, you know, you just... Throw... The sauce over your salmon so that everything can be combined. And then usually in the end, you know, when the food almost done, I usually just add like some vegetables in like the side, just to like cook down in the same coconut curry sauce. I usually just like pop it in, you know, to the side. Look at broccoli, some cauliflower or a cauliflower, as y'all would say. But um, yeah. That's what I do. So guys, I am doing the taste test. Today we have, on our show, we have Ramon. That's me. And then we have Perry again. He's on his way. He's on his way. And I'm not giving them any full plate of food because I don't know why them think so they're a restaurant. Y'all are getting tasters. No, but I'm hungry. And then it's have a, like open up your appetite, don't you? Yeah. Damn. Guys, look at the salmon. Look at that. Looking busting over there. Right. You know. Might as well get him a little taste of them mouths. That's that's what it is, you know? Cause what if them are like it? What if it don't taste good? That's my food wasted. It's not go waste, I promise you that. So Ramon said he wanted the big broccoli. Like yep. said, me never want it for myself. But you know, that's, <laughs> that's okay. Then you take the big salmon and I take the big broccoli. That's compromise. That's fine. I will give you. Thank you, thank you. And then maybe you like a little piece. Okay. Still trying to find a little piece. All of them are the same. Is that okay. sign? That's okay. Let me just, you know, I'll give it to you. Put this back here. Gravy is very important, you know? Right. That's where flavor is. What's the spice like in this? Do you like spicy food? I do. It's not OMG spicy, but you know me, I like my spice. So it how I keep. Okay. But it's not crazy. To me. Okay. Okay, guys, so we have. Right. Right. Again. Mm -hmm. Again. again. <laughs> Ramon. Right. So both of them will be tasting. Honest opinions. You can always come to be honest. Okay. If there's spice in it, you know, you know you'll be with me already. Definitely. Right. Is the rice? Yeah. The rice is rice in today. My wow. rice is rice in today. The texture of the rice? Yeah. Wow. It's rice in today. I don't know, like, I feel like <laughs> when you talk to me and tell me that you're going to cook, it just feel like a simple thing. Like, she's just like, oh, you know, I just stay cold. Like, yeah. stay cold. But, Wait. like, the finished product, it's always giving. We're gonna go to someone now. Talk to you and tell you. I'm gonna leave for a while. Cause. Ramon, I'm gonna it tastes not yet, man. I'm tasting the rice, I'm about to taste the salmon. Come on. Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> yeah. I mean. More in the pot? This is more no, Sunday, like Monday. Like Monday. Sunday yeah. Monday. Okay, Sunday Monday. Sunday Monday. So, uh, so this is your second time? Yeah, this is my second time. Cooking for me. Yeah. So I feel like. Mm -hmm. If you're cooking me a third time, I <laughs> <laughs> you cook this good? I forgot my visual. Not the bijou. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go back to 
I am rich. Right. <laughs> Yo, um, you have to open a restaurant. No, it's in. I I really want to like one day. I was even saying it yesterday. Like, uh, it's uh. You have to go open a restaurant. When you talk about, it is so candid. Like, just like, oh, you're just gonna go cook. And then when you come and you taste the meal, it's like, and you know what? Sometimes I go to restaurants and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna add a little salt or my god, I'm also gonna right. pepper and all this. Mm -hmm. Britney's never cooked for me. And I'm like, I need to add something. Yeah. Because I'm cook or I want food for taste. Right. Like, right. <laughs> so I feel like, I, you know, I, like, I like the little zing, like, I love the little taste of pepper. Yes. That's just me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cook, man. You know? And I've never had curry salmon. Yeah. Much as coconut curry salmon. Mm -hmm. So this is any for me. This is the first. Yeah. I'm gonna finish it still. You have to. No, it's just about to order some food, you know. Oh. And the cookies are the kid kitchen is gonna show up at town. Guys, yeah. this is my Sunday Monday. I'm sorry for who come later, but. <laughs> so that's clean. Oh, you are going in over here. I just had my last. You know, you know, go gym. Why you not eat? <laughs> Why you don't know eat the vegetables? You know the vegetables like that. I promise you. Out of 10. Come, come. Out of 10? 9.5. Nine. 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 Uh, when the door ever want give me ten, I'm sick of no. I am sick. With no juice? I am sick of y'all. Alright, Roman, thank you. So hold on, when we give one juice, it's gonna ten. be a ten. It's a full meal. Okay. okay. Come on. All right. What is it? What but is it? probably I'll make my juice from scratch. I just I was about to blender. I was about to say that. I might yeah. as well. Fresh squeeze some more. Some right? strawberry lemonade. Come Sorry. on, make that already. Right. So we can make it again. Strawberry lemonade next week. How do you get the ten? Got y'all. Hey guys, so this is the end of the video. As y'all can see by the reviews, Ramon and Quack Perry. Perry, why am I saying Quack Perry? Ramon and Perry, the food was busting. It was busting. So, I will see you guys next week. Um, DM me and tell me things on a warm cook or leave it in the comments and I will pick one because I don't know what I'm cooking next week. But don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And goodbye. <laughs>